everybody! This week from the North Country Children's Museum, we're going to make castanets. You'll need cardboard, bottle caps, either metal or plastic, scissors, tape or glue, markers, crayons, or colored pencils. Hi everybody! This is Amelia from the North Country Children's Museum. Today what we're going to do is we're going to make another instrument. Last week we made kazoos, so this week we're going to make castanets, which is a hand percussion instrument. You play them with your hands. Castanets are an instrument from Spain. Flamenco dancers often will play them as they're dancing. Now that you have all your supplies, you're going to cut two pieces of cardboard because you're going to play one in each hand. If you want to just do one, that's totally okay. We're going to make two today though. So you want to make a piece of cardboard about the size um, of between your thumb and your pointer finger. So I already have some cut. I'm going to cut it a little bit just to make it a little um, more even. You, you're going to place your bottle caps right on the pad where your pad of your finger is. So that's about the edge of where you're going to want the cardboard. Now that you're done cutting, you can decorate. I already used some decorative cardboard. My cardboard is red. If you want to um, decorate, that's totally fine. You can do that. So you can use markers, crayons, um, colored pencils. You don't want anything that's going to stick up though because that'll um, change the way that instrument sounds. Now that you've done all that, you can use either tape or glue. Glue honestly would be a little bit better, but we only have tape here, so we're going to use tape. And you're going to put two bottle caps on the edge of all the cardboard. All right, now what you're going to do is you're going to take your tape. You can use whatever tape you have. Um, this is just some scotch tape, but you're going to take your bottle cap and you're going to attach it right, oops, right to the cardboard. Um, you want to attach it with this side up so that it has the most surface area to make your sounds. Now you are ready to play. You're going to hold it in your hands like this. Let's make our other one. All right, just as a reminder, it's probably best to have metal bottle caps. So, if grown-ups, if you have a special drink at night, that's fine. And then you can save the caps and you can make these. I only had two metal bottle caps, so we're going to use the other ones in plastic. They're not going to sound as much, but they'll still make a sound. So now, you have both of yours and you can play along. All right, everybody. Make sure to bring your castanets along next week, along with your kazoo. We're gonna try something a little special next week, so stay tuned. <laughs>